the truth is what I realized writing the book is there's no cure for the voices I have in my head. There's no cure for that anxiety, but it is possible perhaps just to slow down occasionally and to enjoy the good moments, the beautiful moments while they're, while they're happening, rather than look back in a few years time and think I had this really amazing time, but I was so terrified and I was so stressed and I was so anxious and I just, I wasn't there for any of it. I didn't enjoy any of it. So a fire on all sides, it's kind of a, I hope, a kind of slightly wonky roadmap from, you know, the madness of touring and traveling and performing from memory and critics and press and bad pianos and lonely hotel rooms and delayed flights and another taxi and shitty pianos and, and everything else. But it's also about the lovely moments, touring through these amazing cities, playing these incredible pieces of music that since I was a child, I've absolutely fallen in love with. It's not a memoir. It's it's kind of a follow-up to Instrumental, but it's certainly not a memoir, because I've already written one of those. This is more a book about creativity, about passion, about the fact that we're all, perhaps, just a little bit crazy. And you know what? It's okay. <laughs>